Hey, today we're just going to go over real quick how to use Todoist uh, labels and how to do tasks and subtasks. So we've talked about using the asterisk. Um, you can check out the video. I'll link it in the description below if you want to set up a task and use it truly as kind of a, for lack of a better term, label because there's actually something called labels in, um, in Todoist. But uh, you can see that and see, you'll see how to create a task that you can't really delete easily or rather you can't mark as completed. So that's kind of handy depending on what you want. But today I wanted to show you if you're in your main uh, inbox, so either your inbox or today, you know, whichever view you prefer, you may think, oh, okay, well, I've made this task. This is my big task. And then I've got, you know, the subtask. Well, I'll just try to, well, you can't put it anywhere. If you move it around, you're going to, you know, put it above or below something or you're going to end up postponing it to tomorrow. There's no way to do anything from this view. However, what you can do is head over to one of your projects. So basically you need a project. So you can see over here. And then you can say, let's um, say I've got um, big project, I've got do something else, and then a subtask. Okay, I just made these up. Um, you can click what you want to be a subtask and just drag it over. Okay, there you go. And then you get the little, um, I guess, window tab dropper. All right, so you can do that. So pretty easy. Um, it's just kind of confusing. If you're trying to do it from your inbox, that doesn't really work too well or doesn't work. So you need to do it as a project, which makes sense because in a project you would have um, these sort of subtasks. Okay, so the one cool thing about this now, while that may have seemed confusing, is that now when you go back, since this is due today, if you go back to today, you'll see that it's in here, okay? And it works as a drop down. okay? So pretty handy. So you just do this from your project view and you'll be good to go. Hope that helps.